Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take one of these reed blanks and I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna thin it and I'm gonna clip the tip. So I'm gonna thin both sides of the tip and then uh, put it on the chopping block and get it to open up. Um, now the extent that I'm doing it, I'm gonna show you this two ways of how I like to do this. Um, you're gonna to wanna to remeasure 67 to the top of the heart as you're thinning. Um, you would take a pencil and mark where that 67 line is. For me, I'm actually gonna just go ahead and I'm gonna use the tip of my knife because I can see where that is. Um, if you mark it with a pencil, just mark straight across. So I'm looking at where I put the little niche with my knife and there's the, the straight across. Now, if you're using a, a reed knife to do this, it does take quite a bit of time. You wanna make sure that you're aiming essentially in diagonals like so, and then working that way and then that way at the diagonal. So you can kind of see how I'm working, right? So I'm working out to the sides and, and you're essentially, the corner of the top of the heart needs to be at 67 millimeters. Sorry, 66 millimeters, which would be those two corners on each side because the center is at 67 millimeters. That makes these corners at 66. So I'm going to go and expedite this by using a razor blade. <clears throat> and just make sure that you dip the reed every so often in water to keep it pliable. So switching between knife and razor blade could be one option for you. 